all praise and honor to Jesus Christ, the Lord. As I grow older, and you may have a similar experience, I notice that the letters in my books are shrinking and shrinking. Every day they look smaller, and they even have learned how to dance. Well, when I think about this, I think about blindness. And Jesus teaches us that a blind person cannot guide another blind person, for both will fall into a pit. He says that no disciple is superior to the teacher, but when fully trained, every disciple will be like his teacher. The good news that we have for today is that Jesus is our teacher. If we listen to his word and put it into practice, we will become more and more like him. If we are truly his disciples, if we abide in his word and live by it, we will be transformed from glory to glory into his very likeness. Wow, what a destiny. The challenge for us today is to examine the teachers that we are following. Who are we looking up for guidance? Whose teaching are we truly following? Are we embracing worldly wisdom that binds us to this earth? Or are we truly embracing the wisdom with capital W that came down from heaven to show us the way to heaven? That is how are we truly embracing Jesus and his teaching? and following in his footsteps. Jesus is the wisdom of God and the justice of God. May we embrace Christ's wisdom and righteousness in our lives. May we listen to his words and put them into practice. May we let Christ be truly the guide of our lives. Jesus, I trust in you. <music>